Hi guys, welcome to Real Bazaar. Ever heard about Photoshop battles? No? Me neither. That is certainly something new for me. Well, it's a new type of craze that emerged on the net. And, well, I just want to warn you guys that if you post your pictures online, then you better be ready because there are uh, some people out there, Photoshop enthusiasts, who can take your pictures and do some radical changes to them. They can make you look very silly. And you know how things get viral really quickly, so y'all better watch out. You know guys, fantasy has no limits, and Photoshop battles prove that fact very well. So right now we're gonna look at some very interesting and unusual examples that will make you guys laugh real hard. So let's start. So this is a tree that was hit by lightning, and some Photoshop masters managed to capture its suffering quite well. I think I can even hear it yelling. This is Mount Fuji. Well, since it's Japan, there's gotta be Godzilla walking around here somewhere. Yeah, a nice homey type of Godzilla, ready to bake some pastry. Daddy cat and a child cat. I think they both look better on this old school type of picture right here. A toad with snails on its head that looks like Princess Leia. After some Photoshop magic, the resemblance becomes uncanny. That hawk looks like it's staring into the eyes of his deadly enemy. That's a cat beard, and it'll keep you warm. Ask ZZ Top guys, cause they know. You know what? This green reminds me of something. Ah, I know. Ever saw micro shrooms, guys? Without Mario, this picture wouldn't be complete. German Shepherd walking on water. Or is this ice? Well, if it's water, then there's gotta be Jesus in this picture. Trump trying to close his pen. All the emotion he puts in this. For real, it's like he's a little kid playing with his toys. Oh wow, that looks pretty cool. Oh no, Mr. Bean, it was you all along. What a cute little ducky. And now it's a ducky with a pearl earring. Oh my, danger Will Robinson, danger. Oh, that's much better. You should always make friends with ravenous animals. Donald Trump, again, drinking water. Oh, hold on, he's actually sucking out all the life out of Harry Potter. Thanks to Photoshop Masters, the sloth rescue turned into a marvelous performance on ice. That is one nimble leopard. And looks like it's quite witty too. You don't see these guys solving Rubik's cubes very often. I think Edward Munch would love to see the screaming llama. Oh, that's a great shot. A little bit of creative thinking and it looks even better. I wonder whose idea was to put holes in that fence. And what genius did this is even bigger mystery. It looks pretty funny though. Donald Trump, wearing a bathrobe, how sweet. Especially when Mr. Putin is checking him out. Yeah, you don't see a dog wearing shoes every day. And you certainly don't see a dog riding a bike like that. A tit and its prey. There, that's more like it. Makes it more brutal. Really shows you who's the lord of the jungle here. A fallen leaf on a dog's face. How about a spider dog? Everybody knows Captain America, but not many people know about Captain Canada. But wait. There's a third member of the gang. It's Captain Mexico. Stained glass window made that cat look all colorful. And with a little bit of Photoshop, that cat is now a part of the glass itself. Keanu Reeves running away from paparazzi after stealing his camera. And some guys appear to be checking out his butt in motion. That's a strange one. If you think this capybara is playing with monkeys, you're wrong. 
those monkeys are on the same racing team. Impala with a spider web between its horns. And this version proves that this guy took some knitting lessons from his grandma. What a lovely kitten amidst flowers. And now it looks much more like a dragon cat. Donald Trump, oh come on. Dude, why is this guy so aggressive? Ah, I get it. It's just a very emotional puppet show, that's all. Which one of these photos do you guys think is better? There are so many types of caterpillars, all shapes and colors. Those look very unusual, and even scary for some. Yeah, you don't see a porcupine crossing a street on his bag legs too often, especially when it's on its way to a nursing home. This guy playing with tubes had no idea he'd look cool on a cover of the book by Herbert Wells called The War of the Worlds. This dog's face blends perfectly with a cast iron fence. But you know why it looks so sad? Because it was told that it's colorblind. A very rare shot of a snow owl in motion. And now it's peeping from behind the blinds. Parents feeding their children. Now that's what I call a family. Oh god. Man, look at that smutty smile on security guy's face. Hmm, I wonder what a Photoshop variation will be. Ah, your highness, not again. This leopard looks like it's doing something it shouldn't. There, that's more appropriate. And this lovely, but a little angry kitty would fit nicely on a Lion King poster. Synchronized swimming is a truly spectacular kind of sport. But who could have thought that a dark fantasy could make it seem so scary and perverse? Ah, oh, that's so touching. A fireman in front of California forest fires. A little bit of Photoshop and it looks like Mordor. Leo hiding from paparazzi. That's so funny. This hedgehog looks so happy. It's like it's gliding down the water slide. And this cat doesn't look very realistic in that jump. Better fix that. There, that's more like it. This doggy looks so sad. How can a dog look that sad when someone's measuring its height? What the hell is that? Oh, I know. If you play old school games, you'll know what I'm talking about. Kitty, slipping inside a stump. It looks like it's stuck there for good now. A deer with a dead bird on its horns. Is this some kind of new mod craze or something? If you think that, you're probably right. What an incredibly beautiful peacock. There, with a flick of the wrist, it turns into a magnificent waterfall. Dudes running away from rain. A bit of Photoshop, and we get ourselves an alternative Bourne's Identity poster. A watermelon helmet. That's certainly something I've never seen before. Well, why not we take it a little bit further and equip this body with a full package? Police Shepherd, and 10 million dollars around it. Shaggy? What the hell are you doing here, bro? A parrot, by the heater. Well, what did you expect? Where is that cat's buddy? Ah, oh, I get it, it's a Cheshire cat. Dwayne Wade saw a lot of things, but this was the first time he saw a flasher. Aaron Paul seems to be confused about something. I wonder what that is. Ah, okay. Now it's pretty safe to be embarrassed. Now, well, what would you do with a dog who's already looks pretty funny? Alright, I guess it does make for a good waiter. 
It looks like someone's hungry. Or is this the case of someone trying to score big time? Well, either way, good luck there, little snail. Hmm, this dog looks like a... Wait a minute, it looks like a hooker. And that guy in the car looks super disturbing. This is one single most brutal cat I've ever seen in my life. Although this way it looks even more brutal. Damn, that girl is one risky chick. Okay, I guess she's safe now. Hmm, that wouldn't be my first association, but it looks pretty funny, I guess. Guy holding a hot dog in his hands, like it is it's his child or something. Well, let's put him in a frame then. That is one happy mouse. In fact, it's so extra happy that it would be more appropriate to put it on this type of plan, if you know what I'm saying. A guy sitting on a bench during Harvey. Thing is tough? Well, what do you think about this little fella then? Oh man, that is one tough squirrel. I bet it knocks out MMA fighters like crazy. Well, that was funny. Before I say goodbye to you guys, do me a favor, check out my channel, Frickin' Nick. It's right there. Just click it, subscribe, and, you know, let's stick together. Alright guys, that's all for now. Thanks a lot for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed watching it, because I certainly enjoyed making it for you. Press the bell, press the like button, subscribe to Real Bizarre, check out some more Real Bizarre videos, and, you know, let's have fun next time. See ya!